hello everyone welcome to the channel in this video guys we are going to troubleshoot the issue touchpad is not working on our windows 11 and dell laptop so let's move on to the dell laptop so this is my hp laptop and this is my dell laptop okay so what you need to do is you need to guys press windows plus x key together windows plus x key together in order to open the device manager windows plus x key so once you have pressed windows plus x key together use your down arrow key to look for device manager and hit enter so once you have hit enter you need to use your tab arrow key like this dell is highlighted use your down arrow key now and look for the mice and other pointing devices use your right arrow key and in here guys we need to use your down arrow key again and look for these two drivers here this is a remote one but these two drivers hid compliance mouse and ps2 compatible mouse this one is for the mouse and this one is for touchpad so we have to update that so once you have selected hit enter and now we need to go to the driver so use your tab arrow key and once you have uh, the general is highlighted use your right arrow key now use your down arrow key now down use your tab arrow key again and again tab arrow key update driver hit enter search automatically and make sure you are connected with the network if you have mouse also additional mouse so you can directly use your mouse and follow this step but if you don't have the mouse here guys so you have to look for this option again click on this option this time this option and this time choose the let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer now use your latest one and hit enter and if you are able to see multiple options here guys just select one by one all of them and see if that is working fine or not and you have to restart the system it will ask you to restart your system so hit yes and your system is going to restart and if you have the mouse you can use these steps easily so let me again go to the up arrow key okay and if you are not able to see the mice and other pointing devices here we need to go to the view option from on the top ok let me again try ok ok so we are not able to perform this step we have to close this out guys so you have to use the mouse in this case and if this option is not working then you have to look for the touchpad driver from the google search or the other browser which you use so make a double click on the google chrome and in the, on the search result we need to type a dell driver and go to the first link this option driver and download both link are same so you can go to this option driver a download and we have to enter here the serial number so if you want to identify the serial number like this the serial number should be showing like this service tag ok on your system so we can also hit the command prompt here press windows plus r to button type the cmd and hit this command wmic bios get and serial number together the spelling should be like this guys no space between serial and number hit enter so once you have hit enter this is a serial number you need to select this and press c on your keyboard to copy that and you have to enter this here and search it and if it is asking to download the dell support driver here just click that option 
okay let me close this now we need to expand that select here the operating system here so once you have selected operating system this device and the model number tick this option this device and look for the touchpad related driver here uh, so let me show you here guys this is graphic mouse chipset you can also look for this option switch and also intel serial io driver tick this option also this chipset driver and if you are able to find any driver related to touchpad here just select that option and install that option okay once you have selected again you have to restart your system as basic you have to always restart your system once you have selected the driver for your windows so after applying this method guys your issue should fix now okay if you have still issue so you can check for update here so press windows plus i button together and look for the update driver here so down arrow key windows update and simply we need to hit check for update here so once you have check for update it will install the latest package on our windows and see if it fix the issue or not if after applying these methods guys still you have the issue so what you can do is you can power flush on your system so what you need to do is you need to remove all the external cables from your system or uh, on your keyboard like including the power cable also the adapter usb mouse and anyone if connected and press and hold the power key for almost 30 seconds and then wait for 10 minutes and then turn it on your laptop and see if that fix the issue or not so i'm pretty sure guys after applying these methods you are going your issue is fixed now if your issue is fixed then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching